Hello everyone, welcome back to the Dodsification YouTube channel and finally I'm doing another video. Sorry if it's been a while but I'm back now and I'm gonna try and get as much videos as I can out there. I'm, first off I'd like to say sorry about the shaky cam, I am using, I'm not using a tripod, I'm using my hand for this but um, yeah, today we are reviewing uh, the Sting Letter Opener from The Hobbit and Unexpected Journey. Uh, this is made by a company called uh, The Noble Collection. I picked this up at a convention uh, about a month ago or so. Um, very cool, very, very awesome. Um, as you can see, it's in like this wooden box with a hinge, and uh, I believe it's glass. I think it, it may be plastic. I'm not too sure, but uh, it looks it's very well presented and looks awesome. Um, so yeah, let's take a look at the box first. As you can see, it's got a uh, sting written there. It's in like a gold sort of gold paint sort of thing. On the sides of the box, you get these nice designs. You get like the acorn button thing that's on Bilbo's vest. Looks pretty cool. And like a nice elvish patterns. Looks pretty sweet. That go that's on basically all the sides of the box. Pretty cool. Then in the top corner here, you get the Hobbit, an unexpected journey. Which looks pretty sweet and then yeah of course inside the sting swords presented now it is a letter opener but it if you look at it it's, it's pretty much like a miniature replica it looks absolutely sweet uh, love it to bits um, there's a look at the hinge pretty cool uh, for those interested there's the back side Pretty cool. Uh, the box is pretty light. Um, it does feel a little fragile, but yeah, it's all good. So, pop open the hinge. Uh, and there's the sting letter opener. Now, it is um, in their family, so if you like pick it up and turn it upside down, it won't fall out. It's in there pretty good. Um, but very cool. Very nicely detailed. Looks pretty sweet. Uh, love it to bits. Um, it's exactly how it looks in The Hobbit, which is pretty sweet. Take it out. Now this, the sword itself, oh, well, the letter opener, uh, it's got a nice weight to it. It is a very heavy item. It's made out of metal. Uh, it's very, very cool. And it's also very sharp because it is a letter opener. It has to stab the paper and cut it. So it is a very sharp item, but very, very cool. And I love the weight to it. It feels official I guess it's it's got a very nice weight and yeah I just love it feels it's really cool it's basically a little little replica you know if you can hear that it's made out of metal it's got a nice weight to it uh, it's it's sick uh, not much more I can say but yeah it's definitely cool um definitely worth picking up I got it for like I said at a convention for 50 Australian dollars, which I think is worth it. I think it's absolutely, it's a gorgeous piece. It's very cool. If you can't afford like a life, like a life scale, baby, I can't talk today. If you can't afford like a life size sting sword, this is, this is definitely worth getting instead. It's only 50 bucks. Um, a proper sting sword will run you like a hundred or something, a hundred or so, but um, or even more. But yeah, this is. This is awesome, this is very nice, I absolutely love this piece, and the way it's presented in this box is just, in this box is just, it's just awesome, you can't ask for a better collectible than this, um, really love it, you can also get a Glamdering and Orcrist and uh, Thorin's Dwarven Sword in, in this assortment, so that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, very nice sword. Highly recommend it, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.